in the words of Art Williams. What does the A-grade student do that the C-grade student doesn't do? He pays the price a little bit more. He works hard a little bit more. He bleeds a little bit more. He studies a little bit more. He reads a little bit more. If you want to be on the top of your class, you gotta be tough and you can't quit. If you go out there this week and think you're supposed to be somebody and you're gonna do something big and you study hard and you prepare well for your exams and you give it everything within you, you got a chance. It's usually not just one huge decision that you make that makes the biggest impact on your life. It's often all these small decisions that you make throughout the day, the ones that are seemingly insignificant, but they all add up. When it's time to go and study, are you gonna study? Or are you just gonna spend another 10 more minutes scrolling through Instagram? Are you gonna go study for your exam that's coming next week? Or are you gonna watch one more film on Netflix? It's these little decisions that you make that impact your life. When you make your decision, make the right decision. It's one foot in front of the other, one little victory at a time. That's the only way we can do it. That's all it is. You just begin. You solve one problem, then you solve the next problem. Life gives you what you fight for. Life doesn't give you what you want. Everybody would want to pass all their exams all the time, right? Everybody wants to be successful. But life gives you what you work for. If you want to win, you need to show up to your classes and demand success and demand happiness. Desire and determination is everything. It isn't talent, it isn't brains, it isn't luck, it's desire and determination. You've got to have the will and the hunger to study hard and be somebody. This is your life, this is your legacy, this is who you are. You're writing your own history right now. Don't put off your studying until tomorrow because tomorrow will become the next day, and the next, and then the next. Get your studying done today. Decide to be better than you were the previous day. Make the decision to get better grades than you got yesterday. Make the decision to be a better person than you were yesterday. And it all starts by making one seemingly insignificant decision at a time. A lot of students, they, they think they can't get the same grades as their friends that are getting better grades than them. They think that getting an A grade is just too far out of reach. But there are some students that decided within themselves, I'm gonna make it. Some people aren't waiting for the perfect moment. Some people are moving out on their own because they feel within themselves, I got what it takes to make it. They're not afraid about what their friends will think of them or what their teachers or parents will think of them because they know what they deserve. They know what they can create for themselves because these people have decided as they look into the future, nothing can stop them. If you were to write a book based on your life and give it to somebody, would that book be worth reading? If not, you better do something about it. You have the opportunity right now to change that. We've all got 24 hours in a day, all of us. Bill Gates has 24 hours. Barack Obama has 24 hours. Elon Musk has 24 hours. You have 24 hours. But what are you doing with your time? You've got to be honest with yourself. Are you letting time slip by? Wasted? Nobody's going to be doing the studying for you. Nobody's going to be reading the books for you or revising the exam for you. you got to do all that yourself. So what are you doing with your time? Are you studying 9, 10, or even 11, 12 hours a day? Because that's what A-grade students are doing. That's the part you don't see. You only see their grades. You don't see the hours they spend grinding behind their desk. I remember what Jocko Willink once said. My glory doesn't happen in front of a crowd. It doesn't happen in a stadium or on a stage. There's no medals handed out. It happens in the darkness of the early morning in solitude where I try and I try and I try again. You have to try with everything you have to be the best you can possibly be. Better than what your friends thought you could be. Better than what your teachers and parents thought you could be. And when you get an A grade in your next exam, no one can take that away from you. And the next exam, do the same. And the next exam, the same. Before you know it, you'll be on the road to victory. A victory of will and discipline. 
a victory achieved because you will not stop. Create the highest, grandest vision possible because you become what you believe. No matter how crazy it might sound to the other people, who do you want to be? Keep pushing. Make this year the year that you commit to yourself that you're going to make progress.